RJ's cave is changing, and I'm gonna need your help. You heard that right. RJ's cave is changing, and I'm gonna need your help. I'll let you know what's going on. I'll let you know if we're gonna be moving away from doing certain things, and if there's gonna be anything, any new stuff we're gonna be doing, I'm gonna let you know about that. And then I'm gonna definitely need your help, but I'll explain more when we get there. First, I wanna let you know that some of the changes that are coming to RJ's cave is I am gonna be moving a lot of reactions over to the RJ Raves YouTube chat, where I do all the Elite Bata reactions. Yeah, all of his reactions that are on this channel are gonna be going over to that channel. Reason being, he gets a lot of attention and that can confuse the algorithm if I'm trying to get views on something other than reactions to him. So that's why I originally started the RJ Raves channel in the first place. But with these videos here, they're still in the, the viewing queue, let's call it. And uh, so they still get views sometimes and that informs the algorithm that in, what, in that way, it, does, it doesn't really feed the guitar stuff to the audience the way it feeds the Elite Bata stuff out there because it thinks everybody wants that. So I had to separate all that. Okay, so if you want to watch Elite Bata stuff, please head on over to RJ Raves. I got tons of reactions over there. I'm putting another 50 up there now. And uh, so you'll, you'll have plenty to watch over there. Okay, so don't feel bad. If you're here, if you're here and you've subscribed here, you're probably a member over there as well. If you're here for the Elite Bata videos anyway, so uh, you've probably seen it all anyway. But that's what's going on with that. So that stuff is moving and it's going over to the other channel. But that's all that's moving. Uh, well, that's not entirely true because I'm also going to have to close the members area. I knew going into the, opening the members area that it might be a dud. Right. As a matter of fact, all the YouTube specs told me I probably wouldn't get a whole lot of subscribers, if any. And guess what? I didn't get any. But it's not a big deal. I wanted to do this to see what the demands on me would end up being once I did that. So it was a learning experience. I got something out of it. So we'll revisit that possibility in the future of the chat. All right. So. There is one thing that I need your help with, and it is uh, something that is going to be added to the channel, all right? With this whole issue of needing to let the algorithm know that this is really about guitars, I wanted to add some more content, guitar content, to the things that we do on the channel. So, I've been working on my first of what I hope will be a full series of interviews with small YouTubers like this channel. Uh, guitar channels that are doing it, it right or they're really trying hard to do it right and they have something to offer and if you know of any of them that and you like them and you want to let me know please do that okay uh, in the community pages on the upper right hand corner you can find my email you can just put it in a comment if they're okay with that kind of thing in case somebody else gets their info uh, whatever you want to do let me know okay uh, and throughout over time, if you happen to find more of these channels, let me know. All right. And I will check them out. I will subscribe to them and I will watch their videos and I will see if they're a good fit. They're a guitar channel. They should be a good fit. So, and then I will hit them up and ask them if they'd like to take part in this. All right. It's like five to 10 questions, depending on the type of guitar YouTuber they are. And, uh, meant to be uh to inform you about them as well as give you a little information if you're a brand new beginner or something like that so again if you know of anybody who you think would make a really good candidate for that let me know all right another thing you can do to help out the channel is if you have made it this far i know you like the video so how about smashing the like button all right also consider subscribing or don't consider it just do it Ring the notification bell while you're there, all right? Because that way you'll know whenever we post a new video. And we get to see each other more often, all right? It works out for both of us. If you want to tip the channel, we appreciate it. We really use it, too. 
You do that by smashing uh, the super thanks button down below the video, and uh, that's a real easy thing to do. We also have the merchandise. We have the RJ's Cave t-shirts, the coffee mugs, as well as other guitar-related tees and mugs as well. So if you're a guitar player or you know a guitar player and you need to give a gift this holiday season, go check that out, okay? The stuff's not that expensive. Coffee mugs are ranged from like $13 to $16, and the shirts are all around $20, bucks, right? $20, $25. So anyway, you guys have been awesome. I've been RJ. Thanks for joining me. Until the next one, take care.